Hi, welcome to Bigo TV. In this episode, we'll be working with the GNW Viper S recloser. We're going to be swapping out the Switzer SEL 351R2 recloser control with a brand new Beckwith electric M7679 recloser control. For this installation, you will need an application guide, 2410 adapter chassis, a quarter or a nickel, a 1 8 precision screwdriver blade, a number 2 Phillips screwdriver, a 3 8 nut driver, 11 30 seconds nut driver, an M7679 recloser control mounted to a 2410 adapter chassis. Prior to removal and installation of your recloser control, please observe your utility safety procedures. Also, please verify that the control is in the open position. Also verify that 120 has been removed and the battery has been disconnected. At this point, verify that the recloser has been powered off. To begin the removal process using the tools mentioned beforehand and using the application guide, first remove the Molex connectors. Phillips screwdriver, remove your ground cable. With your 1 8 blade screwdriver, remove the green Phoenix connectors. And lastly, grab your 3 8 nut driver and remove the nuts on the C-clamps on top of the box. And that finishes the removal process of the harness. To remove the Schweitzer control, grab your 11 seconds nut driver and remove these six nuts that are along the side of the control. Five. Make sure to hold the control so it doesn't fall to the ground. And that completes removal of the SEL 351R2. For the installation of the M7679 recloser control, which happens to be mounted on our M2410 adapter chassis, first we will slide it onto the six mounting bolts. Make sure you secure it so it doesn't fall off. And with your 11 seconds nuts, 
begin to install the adapter chassis to the front panel. Next, we'll be attaching a cable harness back to the chassis. To do that, we will need to move these seat clamps in position with these two Phillips screws that are attached to the chassis. To do that, you'll need your Phillips 2 screwdriver. Move the screws. and simply attach the seat clamps to the 20, M2410 adapter chassis. After that's done, we could begin the reverse process with the connectors. First, connect this Phoenix connector and tighten it up with your 1 8 blade screwdriver. Bottom Phoenix green connector, same thing, tighten it up. Attach the white Molex connectors. And finally, attach your ground wire. That completes the installation process of the M7679 recloser control. After completing the installation of the M7679 control, please verify that everything is in good order and safe. Apply 120 back to your recloser and connect the battery. Now we can close the front panel and verify that the recloser operates. I'll do a trip. And I'll reclose it. That concludes our installation of the M7679 recloser control to a GNW Viper S. 
please stay tuned for more episodes and thank you for watching Vico TV.